Once upon a time in a small Zen monastery there was a young and dedicated student named Akio. He had been studying Zen for several years and his practice was focused on achieving enlightenment. One day his teacher a wise and respected Zen master gave him a task that would test his patience and mindfulness. He was instructed to keep a single candle flame burning steadily all night long without letting it flicker or die. Akio was excited to receive such an important task from his teacher. He found a small room where he could focus on the task at hand and he set up the candle on a wooden table. He prepared himself by meditating for a while, clearing his mind and calming his breath. For the first few hours, everything went smoothly. He watched the flame carefully, making minor adjustments to the wick and blowing on it to keep it steady. But as the night progressed, the flame began to act unpredictably. It flickered and danced, sometimes growing brighter and sometimes dimmer, no matter what Akio did to control it. He became increasingly anxious and frustrated, wondering if he was failing his teacher and his practice. Akio began to obsess over the flame, trying harder and harder to control it. He found himself blowing on it more frequently and adjusting the wick every few minutes. However, despite all his efforts, the flame continued to flicker and dance, seemingly mocking his attempts to control it. As the night wore on, Akio's frustration turned into desperation. He felt like he was losing his grip on the task and his practice. He started to doubt his abilities and wondered if he was cut out for the rigorous practice of Zen. Suddenly, a gust of wind blew through the small room, causing the flame to waver wildly. Akio felt like he was losing the control completely. But then he had a realization. The flame was teaching him a lesson about impermanence and the futility of trying to control everything. No matter what he did, the flame would continue to flicker and dance, just as life would continue to be unpredictable and ever-changing. Akio realized that the flame was not something to be controlled, but something to be observed and accepted. He let go of his need for control and simply watched the flame, accepting it for what it was. He stopped trying to adjust the wig or blow on the flame and just observed it, letting it be. And in doing so, he found a deep sense of peace and contentment. As the sun began to rise, a curious teacher came to check on him. When he saw the flame still burning steadily, he smiled and congratulated Akio on a job well done. But Akio knew that it was not his control that had kept the flame steady, but his acceptance of its permanence. He had learned a valuable lesson that would stay with him for the rest of his life. From that day on, Akio practiced with a newfound sense of acceptance and peace. He realized that the flame had been a powerful teacher, showing him the way to a deeper understanding of the nature of life itself. And he would always be grateful for the lesson he had learned on that long and difficult night.